Hey everybody, this is Dave Pilkey, and today we're going to draw a new character that no one has seen yet. This is a character named Snug, and he's from the upcoming book, Grime and Punishment. Okay, we're going to start by drawing his helmet, which is kind of like drawing the letter M, and then close it off at the sides. Now, we're going to draw a curved line at the top, and align up the center like this. And then this helmet has some tailpipes on either side, which are just curved lines. They go up like this, and this. And then we close them off at the top. And we do the same thing on the other side here. And like this. And then close them off at the top. Okay, now two lines over here for eyes. And then a little circle for the nose. We go down and a little smile. Okay, I'm going to give you some spoilers. So the helmet that we just drew is called the motor brain and it's a personality amplifier so if somebody puts it on their personality becomes amplified exponentially and it turns them into a monstrous version of whoever they are that can be a good thing or a bad thing and in this case Big Jim is the person or the cat who has put it on and the motor brain has turned him into a gigantic lovable, huggable, squeezable character named Snug. So Snug has these gigantic arms and these arms are super muscular but they're just kind of like I used to draw muscles when I was a kid. I would just draw really big lumpy squishy arms like this. At the shoulders they were nice and thick and they kind of tapered off when they got close to the hands. Now we're going to draw his body, which is nice and round, and then we're going to put a couple legs down here. And the legs are kind of like mini versions of the arms. Big and lumpy, and they taper off towards the bottom, and we'll add a couple feet there. Okay, now we're going to draw his body. So we draw his shirt, which has gotten very, very small. And then this line is for his pants. And this is his pectoral muscle here. And his other pectoral muscle here. And this is his six pack right here. And we'll draw a line across. This is kind of his stripe. And we're going to draw another line here. And of course, we can't forget his trademark letter J. And then, right by his arms and his legs, we're going to draw some little V-shapes to make it look like his shirt and his pants have torn because he's grown so large that his shirt and his pants kind of got ripped. Then we're going to add some, just some random lines across his arms and legs. These are his stripes because he's, Big Jim is a striped cat. And he's got a little tail over here, and that is striped as well. So here we have it. This is Big Jim after he has put on the motor brain and transformed into the insuppressible snug. Take care of each other. Do good for each other. Have fun. Keep writing. Keep drawing. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.